Do you know how many times I've been asked the question, how do you set your bike up for the perfect pre-race photo for the gram? Zero times, that's how many times I've been asked. In the history of all of the questions in all of the lands, I've never been asked that question. But I thought it'd be fun to make this video anyway. So here are a few pointers to get the perfect pre-race bike shot for the gram or the book or whatever social media platform your heart desires. Now, first tip, find yourself a cool little laneway, exhibit A, uh, or a cool wall whoop, to set your bike up against. Now, if you're using a laneway and you don't have a wall to prop the bike up against, you can use a stick or I've also seen people use drink bottles to prop the bike up against. Now, once you've found the perfect backdrop for your bike, you need to make sure the bike is set up properly. First thing, you need to make sure the drivetrain is facing the camera. No one wants to see the other side of the bike. They want to see all the cool stuff. Make sure the crank, so that would be the right crank, is at 3 p.m. So basically facing at the front of the bike. Throw it in the big chain ring because it's cooler. Uh, and then the tinier details, make sure the valve or the valve extenders are at the bottom of the wheel, so it's six o'clock. Uh, and I also make sure that the skewers are flush up against uh, the forks, so you don't see any skewers sticking out from the other side. Now finally, make sure your bike is nice and clean, but I'm going to assume that it is because you've already taken it to your local bike shop and given it its final service before race day. Clean bike saves watts. Make sure you get the right angle when you're playing around. Do a few different, um, I'm doing that because I assume that you're doing it with a smartphone, uh, but make sure you try different angles, see what it looks like. So, here's an example. Let's go have a look. you wish to use. Uh, 